What's up, everybody? It's CMP with Craftmaster Productions and Studio12Tutorials.com. Don't forget to stop by Studio12Tutorials. Pick up your premium membership. It is 50 cents a day. And also, please do not forget to stop by CMPKits.com. Get yourself a sample pack. Get yourself a MIDI kit. Get yourself one of our amazing chords for scaler preset packs. Check out Shane's newest drop reintro and let us know what you think. Also, please don't forget to follow me on IG. If you ever need to cuss me out, ask me a question. That is the easiest way to get to me. Now, real quick, I want to show you guys. This is a response to a video I uploaded about a year ago where I was, um, I've been helping people in the comments, but I just want to help everybody out real quick. Um, it was about how to get a classic drum a machine swing inside of Studio One. There's an awesome resource in here, um, but I realized that it's a little hard to get to, right? So in the other video, I shared the ISO file and that doesn't work for loading. So let me show you guys how to do it. Um, what you want to do is you want to go over to the exchange. Now, I was really disappointed by how many people I told to go to the exchange and they all said, what? So in your browser, if you go over to, if you go over here and you select cloud, you have two choices. You have your SoundCloud uh, account, which I, you guys should definitely be taking advantage of being able to use Studio One SoundCloud integration. And then you also have the PreSonus Exchange. Double click on the PreSonus Exchange and there is a whole lot of free presets, macros, um, patterns, um, different um, different pitch names for different uh, um, plugins. You know what I mean? Like it's it, it, if you use like Abbey Road drums, you you download you download this you load it in and you put you put the drum um view on and it will have it'll have the uh the actual names of of the samples like kick snare hi-hat ride symbol or whatever um already pre-loaded for you so yeah you guys should definitely be taking advantage of that but we want to know about these mpc grooves the 1000 grooves the the legendary 3k swing right um so your first instinct will be to go to grooves. They're not in there. They're in sound sets. And then you want to scroll down to logic cafe. And then you'll see right here, you have uh, the options for the MPC 1000 grooves, the MPC 3000 view uh, 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 grooves. You have the SPS one, the uh, SP 1200, the ASR 10 grooves. All right. So all the different, all the different quantizes that, um, come from these legendary drum machines, right? I mean, they even have the Oberheim DX, which is awesome. So um, all you got to do to install these onto your system, you just go ahead and click install um, <clears throat> and it'll happen. It'll happen super fast. Uh, you go ahead and install it. And now when you go to your quantize menu and you click down here, they'll be here. So I can use, so if I want to make, you know, some type of, you know, some type of boom bap beep that's reminiscent of a Kai swing, uh, it's all right here with every, you know, they have the 16th and the eighth note functions, or I can use the ASR 10, 16, 16 T boom. So I could get, you know, I could get into either one of those bags easily. So this is CMP with Craftmaster Productions, studio12tutorials.com. You guys keep it simple, but do not be basic, and we will see you on the next one.